The difference between criminal and civil cases can be confusing, and I think that trips up a lot of survivors of sexual assault or rape. Here are the key differences. A criminal case is usually about prison time for the attack. It's not about compensation for the victim, although there may be some of that. There could be a little bit of money in something called restitution, um, and there could be some closure for the victim or for the survivor. But in the main, a criminal case is about putting the attacker in jail. Second, a criminal case is brought by a prosecutor, either for the state or federal government. In other words, it is the government who is driving that case. The government decides whether to bring it. The government decides what to do with the case once it has been brought. We talk with a lot of survivors who are frustrated at the governmental reaction to their cases. They say the police won't do anything, the prosecutor won't bring the case, and sometimes, unfortunately, that is true. That's a governmental decision, and there's not anything we can do about that, but let's talk about civil cases. Civil cases are different. Civil cases are what our law firm brings. A civil case usually seeks financial compensation, that is money, for the survivor of the sexual assault or rape. And importantly, a civil case is something that is brought by the survivor, usually with the help of a lawyer or a law firm. That's what we do.